Blessings and welcome to your program Shalom Shalom Barakat wa ahlan wa salam bikum fi barnamikum Salam Salam With your host Ma'amudi Fitkum Reverend Dexter Pelser Al-Akh Dexter And Dr. Marisol Pelser And Dr. Marisol Pelser And Sister Louise Wa ana uktukam Louise Amen Amen She's a blessing Amen Um, today's program Today, in the hard barnamik al-yom It's critical برنامج حرج. The word of God says. كلمة الله بتقول. Show you study to show yourself approved. إن إحنا نمتحن ونزكي أنفسنا. By studying. بدراسة. We guard our life. بإن إحنا ندرس ونحرس حياتنا. The title of the program. عنوان برنامج اليوم. Testing the truth. إن إحنا نمتحن الأمور ونثبت صحتها. And we test the truth with the word of God. With the word of God. So Brother Dexter is going to be teaching how to use the word to test programs on TV including ours. Prophetic word, books that you may read, the preaching in your church, because that's what we're told to do in the word of God, to test everything. But before we start, we're going to pray for the prayer request. Amen. 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 And brothers and sisters, welcome. We love you. Let's pray first for the program. Father, in the name of Jesus, we're learning about your truth. We ask you to open up our eyes to see the truth. Open up our spiritual ears to hear the truth. Open up our hearts to receive the truth. And renew our minds with the truth. In the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, have your way with each one of us. And teach us your ways. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Well, brothers and sisters, we this is our, this is our time when we pray together. For when one is suffering in the body, we are all suffering in the body. The word says when one has joy, we all have joy with them. So let's pray together for those with needs. So, Father, in the name of Jesus, we come in unity of faith before you. All of us here at the altar, and all that are home or wherever they are watching, we come to you in one faith. So, Father, we pray for Osama Nadi. By the precious stripes of the Lamb of God, your legs be healed. We command the pain to come out of those legs. No more pain in the name of Jesus. Spirit of infirmity, you must come out of him in Jesus' name. Amen. And Mona Makare. Mona Makari. Makari, thank you. Um, she has a backache. So, Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, align her spinal cord. Align it straight in the name of Jesus. By the precious stripes of the Lamb of God. Heal her back. And all pain in your back, go in Jesus' name. And spirit of infirmity, you must come out of her. In the name of Jesus. And we plead the blood over the lamb over you. To heal every cell of your body. In Jesus' name. And uh, your husband, Philip. Philip. We pray for you, Philip. 
that the Lord will bring into your life godly men that you will have fellowship with and a spiritual father who will help you to grow up in Christ be blessed with godly friends that will influence your life and be a blessing to your wife and I bless your marriage in the name of Jesus. Feriel Shaker? Shaker? From Jordan? She's a widow? So Feriel? Feriel? The Lord bless you. The Lord is your husband. In accordance with the word of God. And he is your loving father. And I ask that father you surround her with your love. And as a bride. As a bride to you. Jesus she knows the fullness of your love. And bless her with her provision for all of her needs. And bless her with friends that will come forth in the community to visit her and to be a blessing to her in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. And Miriam, Miriam, Miriam from Australia. Um, we bless you to to be reunited with your house and your family. We bless you to be one family blessed under the Lord. In the name of Jesus. And um, uh, there's a husband and wife that have been married for 15 years. And they're struggling in their marriage. So, Father, in the name of Jesus, we bless their covenant of marriage. And, Lord, in the name of Jesus, we ask you to fill them with the Holy Spirit and bless them with the fruit of the Spirit. Love, compassion, mercy, forgiveness. Father, I ask you to ignite their love for each other, that you would return their hearts to their first love for each other and for you. And Father, point their eyes to you, and then as they come to you, unite them together in love in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. And um, Abu Nab, Abu no. Abu no, from Lower Egypt, Min, uh, Saeed, has heart disease. And so, Father, we bless your heart. Be, we bless your heart by the precious stripes of the Lamb of God. Heart be healed. Arteries and veins be opened for proper blood flow in the name of Jesus. And Father, strengthen the heart and bring back a regular heartbeat in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. And uh, for Samia, um, protection from the lies of the devil. We pray Psalm 91 protection over you. And we plead the blood of the Lamb as a threshold over your, your house. That no darkness may enter in the name of Jesus. The blood of the Lamb protects you in the name of Jesus. And we command you, Satan, and the demonic forces, we bind you, we command you to leave her mind and her thoughts in the name of Jesus. And now in accordance with Hebrews 9, 14, 
Father, wash your mind clean. يا رب اغسل عقلها. And protect her thoughts. وأحمي أفكارها. To be pure thoughts. لكي تكون أفكار نقية. Holy Spirit, I ask you to fill her. روح القدس أطلب أنك تملأها. And bring pure thoughts. وت وتأتي بالأفكار النقية لها. Through her mind, in the name of Jesus. في عقلها في اسم الرب يسوع. We declare and decree. بنتفق ونعلن. That no weapon formed. أن أي آلة صورت. Of the enemy will prosper. أي آلة صورت ضد من العدو لا تنجح. Against the peace and joy. ضد سلامها أو ضد فرح. Of the Lord. ضد سلام أو فرح الرب. Be blessed with the peace and joy. كوني مباركة بالسلام والفرح. Of the Lord, in the name of Jesus. من الرب في اسم الرب يسوع. Amen. Amen. And a prayer for um, Harid. Uh, hen. Uh, I'm sorry, Hen. Well, hen. with the allergies. And the hassasia. Um, by the precious stripes. بجلادات الحمل. Of the Lamb of God. حمل الله. Be healed. أشفي. And the spirit of infirmity over allergy. كل روح ضعف وروح حسية. We command you to come out of her body. نأمرك أن تتركي جسدها. And never return. ولا ترجعي سنية. In the name of Jesus. في اسم الرب يسوع. We plead the blood of the Lamb over you. نروش دم الحمل على حياتك. And pray Psalm 91 protection over you. ونصلي مزمور واحد وتسعين للحماية. And you are healed in Jesus' name. وتكوني مشفية في اسم الرب يسوع. Mosan, Mosan, Malak. Malak. Your sickness be healed in the name of Jesus. مرضك يشفى في اسم الرب يسوع. Mary Nabil. Mary Nabil. Is going to have surgery for her knees. هتعمل جراحة في الركبة. So Father, we bless the doctors and the nurses. أبانا بنبارك الطبيب والممرضات. We ask you to give them your wisdom. بصلي أنك تعطيهم حكمتك. For the surgery to heal her in the name of Jesus. في الجراحة وأن تشفيها في اسم الرب يسوع. We bless your knees. بنبارك رك to return to proper functioning in the name of Jesus. We plead the blood of the Lamb to clean out all that is not of you and Father, restore all that is of you into her knee in Jesus' name. Um, Awatef um, has Kidney disease. And they have مشاكل في الكلى مرض في الكلى. So Father, we curse the kidney disease in your in your kidney. أبانا بن بنال عن كل مرض في الكلى. We command it to die. ونأمر هذا المرض أن يموت. Now Father, we plead the blood of the lamb over her kidney. بنروش دم الحمل على الكلى. To cleanse it and heal it. لتطهرها وتشفيها. Because by the stripes of Jesus Christ. لأن بجلادات الرب يسوع. Be healed in Jesus' name. تكوني مشفية في اسم الرب يسوع. We proclaim Psalm 103:2. بنطلب بنصلي بمزمور 103. That we forget not all the benefits. أن لا ننسى. Of our Lord. كل حسنات الرب وبركاته. That not only are all your sins forgiven. ليس فقط أن خطاياك غفرت. But in accordance with the word, all of your diseases are healed. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. And Mina, Mina um, has a pain in the left eye. And it's going to have surgery. So Father, we bless the surgery to heal the eye. In the name of Jesus. Father, bless the doctors and the nurses. With supernatural wisdom. And guide their hand during the surgery. To heal and repair the eye. In Jesus' name. Lord, we ask you to release. The bomb of Gilead. The bomb of Gilead. By the anointing. Release the anointing. To take away the pain. In the eye, in the name of Jesus. Amen. And Kamal. 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 Barsam. Has diseases, so we proclaim. Psalm 1032. That not only are your sins forgiven, but in the name of Jesus, all of your diseases are healed in Jesus' name. We release that word into your body. We command all the diseases to go in Jesus' name. And Albert uh, Tofik. Is is asking for healing. So we pray healing over your entire family, Albert. 
by the stripes of the Lamb of God. Be healed in Jesus' name. We plead the blood of the Lamb through your whole body to heal your bodies in Jesus' name. And uh, last prayer for Angela for healing. Be healed in the name of Jesus. And Angela, the Lord loves you. And Father, I ask for the knowledge of the glory of the Lord to be known in every household that is asked for prayer. That the word of their testimony will release the word of your glory throughout all their communities in the name of Jesus. And we thank you for the healings. We thank you for the blessings. Father, in the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 What a blessing. Amen. So, Brother Dexter, how do we study to make sure that to test things? How do we do that? Amen. Well, we're going to start because the Lord gave Marisol um, dreams the last two nights. And it was about what he wanted us to teach. And the essence of this teaching is that each one of us are to diligently read the Word of God daily. And that's how we will be sanctified. And that's how we'll be approved by God. And that's how we'll protect our families. And receive all the promises of God. By knowing what the word says. And we'll close the door. To the devil destroying us. Because the word says. My people perish. For lack of understanding. And we have seen testimony of testimony about this. Of people being destroyed. Because they are doing something against God's word. And they don't even know it. So Marisol, I want you to just tell about the first dream, not the second one. Marisol, the first dream that you have so people understand what God is trying to show us. Um, my first dream was very interesting. I had a dream Helen? that, um, do you mean the, the which one do you want me to talk about? The those? sharpened pencils. Okay, I had a dream that there was a teacher. And she had in her hand a whole bunch of sharpened pencils. And that her students we're going to take a very important test. But لكن, they wanted her to take the test for them. لكن, لكن but she said, no. قالت, you have to prepare yourself to, you, to take your test. Amen. That was the dream. Amen. That was the first one. Amen. 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 And Marisol, Amen. then the Lord gave us the interpretation of that. Which is, we cannot rely on someone else to read the word of God for us and tell us what to do. We have to read the word for ourselves. Know the word by ourselves. So that when we take the test, we pass the test and are sanctified into the image of Christ. 
We're not meant ليس مقصود لنا to just go to church on Sunday أن نذهب إلى الكنيسة يوم الأحد فقط hear a sermon for 20 minutes ونسمع الخدمة لمدة 20 دقيقة and then go back into the world ونذهب إلى العالم مرة أخرى and never read the word during the week ولا نقرأ الكلمة خلال الأسبوع because the Lord showed me something لأن الرب أراني شيئا let's say I have a sin in my life دعوني أقول على سبيل المثال إذا كانت قطية هناك قطية في حياتي and let's say the pastor doesn't teach about the sin وعلى سبيل المثال أن القصة لا يعلم عن هذه القطية for five years لمدة خمس سنوات it takes him five years to get to a, to a sermon on that sin خمس سنوات لم أسمع أي خدمة عن هذه القطية what's going to happen to me in that sin for those five years ماذا سيحدث لي مع هذه القطية في مدة خمس سنوات am I ever going to repent هل, هل سأتوب probably not قد من المحتمل لا. Can no one's told me it's a sin? لأن لم يخبرني أحد أن هذه خطية. And the devil can have a stronghold over me. وأخذ الشيطان حصن قوي في حياتي. He can be destroying me. ليدمرني. For five years. لمدة خمس سنوات. Because I'm committing adultery. لأني أرتكب الزنا. And I don't even know it's a sin. ولا حتى أعرف أن هذه خطية. Or. أو. I'm eating too much food. أو أنني آكل كثير من الطعام. I'm gaining weight and more and more weight. وأكتسب مزيد ومزيد من الوزن. And I'm giving the devil authority. وأعطي الشيطان هذه الفرصة أو السلطة. To take my life early. أن يأخذ حياتي. Because I have the sin of gluttony. لأني عندي قطية الشر في الطعام. But no one preaches about the sin of gluttony. لكن لا أحد يوعظ أو يخدم عن النهم في الطعام. So instead of me living to be 80 years old. فبدلا من أن أعيش لمدة 80 عام I get a heart attack and I die when I'm 50 تأتي أزمة قلبية فأموت وأنا في الخمسين من عمري Brothers and sisters أخواتي وأخواتي This is real هذا الأمر حقيقي It happens every day ويحدث كل يوم Amen Marisol It happens every day نعم يحدث كل يوم The devil will destroy us الشيطان يريد أن يهلكنا Because we don't test everything لأننا لا نمتحن كل الأمور that we hear and that we do in life against the word. So let's go and see what the word says. Yeah, go ahead, Marisol. I have, the Lord says, you want wisdom. Search deeply his word. إذا كنت تريد الحكمة ابحث بعمق في كلمة الله وطبق الكلمة على حياتك وسوف تكون منتصر أنت تريد الحكمة أنت تريد أن تكون في أمان اقرأ كلمة الرب ورب سوف يريك كيف تكون في أمان الحكمة ومعرفة الكلمة بعمق آمين and Marisol, that Marisol. what she just said is in Proverbs chapter 2, verses 1 through 15. Read that. And you will see that if you read the word of God and seek wisdom, you will be stunned of the blessings in your life. And, you know, I didn't intend to read it, but let's turn to Proverbs 2. Let's test the prophetic word. Yeah. We're testing a prophetic word right now. Right, this was, this was unplanned. Amen. Proverbs 2, verse 1. I'll read verse by verse, if that's okay, Luis. Okay. All right. Verse 1, my son, if you receive my words and treasure my commands within you, so that you incline your ear to wisdom and apply your heart to understanding. So remember, this started with receiving the word of God. This whole reading is based on that. Now verse 3. Yes, if you cry out for discernment and lift up your voice for understanding, if you seek her as silver and search for her as for hidden treasures, that's searching the word of God. 
deeply. Looking for the treasures. Amen. Amen. Then you will understand the fear of the Lord. And find the knowledge of God. For the Lord gives wisdom. From his mouth come knowledge and understanding. See, so first you seek wisdom through the word of God diligently. And now these verses tell you what God gives you in wisdom. Verse 7. He stores up sound wisdom for the upright. He is a shield to those who walk uprightly. And give you victory. That's so right. Yeah. Yeah. He guards the paths of justice and preserves the way of his saints. So I just see this. I see a narrow path of salvation and a narrow path of sanctification of walking in his perfect will when you diligently seek the word he, he will keep you on that path through the word that's why the word says the word of God is a lamp unto my feet amen verse amen. 9 then you will understand righteousness and justice equity and every good path when wisdom enters your heart and knowledge is pleasant to your soul. Is it the Yes. And say, Lord, we want wisdom to enter our heart. Father, we want it. We want it. We want it. Father, I declare we receive it, Lord. We want it desperately. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Verse 11. Discretion will preserve you. Understanding will keep you. I love this verse. To deliver you from the way of evil. From the man who speaks perverse things or false things into your life. From those who say they're Christians but leave the paths of uprightness to walk in the ways of darkness. Who rejoice in doing evil and delight in the perversity of the wicked. Whose ways are crooked and who are devious in their minds. Wow. Yeah. You seek the word and wisdom like silver, precious. And through the word, he will protect you. He will keep you on the narrow path. He will deliver you from false words from friends or enemies. That's amazing. We could almost stop our teaching. <laughs> yeah, go ahead, Marisol. I see a man. He is in the army. And he's a man that, that is an influential man. And the Lord says to you, I will give you the wisdom for you to walk in the calling of administration over your nation. Just ask me. Ask me. I'm calling you to protect many. And I'm giving you the wisdom of how to do it. Ask me. Ask me. And I will reveal it to you in dreams and visions. 
Thank you, Father. Shukran Amen. 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 And we come in agreement yes. with your prayers. Yes. The Father, you will anoint him with this. Teach him the anointing. And bless his nation. In Jesus' name. And I feel the Spirit moving, so he's moving in your life. Hallelujah. Amen. Oh, I saw Yeah, the Spirit's all over me. Amen. Thank you, Father. Okay. The Word. Luis. Yes. I can't wait. First Thessalonians 5:21. Test all things. Hold fast to what is good. <laughs> what are we to test Marisol? All things. Yes. That's pretty comprehensive. Yeah. Everything. We're going to see in a moment. We test it against the word of God. Yeah. So let's keep going. Second Timothy 2 verses 15 and 16. Be diligent to study to present yourself approved to God. A worker who does not need to be ashamed, rightly dividing the word of truth. That word diligent means you do it all the time. You study the word, and as you study the word, God will change your life. And you will learn to rightly divide the truth. And hold that thought because we're going to go to another scripture. That shows that. Um, and actually, yeah, let's turn to that now. Hebrews 5.14. Because I want to make sure we get this point. لا حتى نفهم هذه الآية ونتأكد من أننا فهمناها تماما. And this is a word for every one of us. وهذه الكلمة هي لكل واحد مننا. Let's start with Hebrews 5:13. في عبرانين خمسة وعدد تلاتاشر. For everyone who partakes only of milk. Hebrews 5:13. لأن كل من يتناول اللبن هو عديم الخبرة. is unskilled in the word of righteousness. هو عديم الخبرة في كلام البر. for he is a baby. لأنه طفل. but solid food belongs to those who are mature. وأما الطعام القوي فللبلغين. that is. الذي. those who by reason of practice. الذين بسبب التمرن. Have their senses exercised to discern between good and evil. Wow. Yeah. We can be a baby. And we can hear a false word. We can follow it. And the devil can destroy us. Or through practice, and knowing the word of God, we can learn to discern between good and evil every day of our life. In everything we do, and how we respond to what everyone says to us. Because here's the thing, precious brothers and sisters, there are always people speaking into our life. Telling us what we should be doing. What we need to do. Who we should give our money to. Always giving us advice. Much of that advice. 
The devil will use to take us off the calling of God. All the time he will divert us to the left or right off of that narrow path with false words. But if we diligently read the word of God through practice we will discern the true from the false a good word in our life versus a word from Satan. Even if it comes from your best friend or a teacher on TV. Amen. Amen. And, and constant means spending time with God reading the word Asking the Holy Spirit through prayer to apply it to your life. So you can repent, change, be guided, develop discernment, and walk in victory. That's right. Let's see a practical application of this in the Word of God. Revelation 2.2, the last book of the Bible. This is Jesus' words to the church. Let's see what he says. He says, I know your works, your labor and your patience, and you cannot... And you cannot bear those who are evil. And you have tested those who say they are apostles and are not. And have found them liars. Yeah. We taught on recognizing false prophetic words and false prophets. Never be enamored with the person's title. You test all things. Even if it comes from your own pastor. And we're going to see that in a second. Test all things. And you will be able to discern between good and evil. Between a true prophet and a false prophet. And a true apostle and a false apostle. Because the word says that many follow the false apostles and they fall off a cliff. They're all led to destruction. We can't afford that in our lives. We must follow Jesus in his calling and perfect will for our life all the time. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So let's keep going. Acts 17. Actually, I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, Acts 1711. This is going to surprise you. <laughs> this is Paul preaching. <laughs> the Apostle Paul. <laughs> who wrote more of the New Testament than anyone else. <laughs> the Apostle to the Gentiles. <laughs> the Apostle to the Gentiles. <laughs> Listen to what the word says about testing what he says. This is the church in Berea. And it says these Bereans were more fair-minded than those in Thessalonica. In that they received the word with all readiness. And searched the scriptures daily to find out whether these things were true. Paul, what Paul said was true. This is the Apostle Paul. 
هنا رسول بولس الذي يتكلم so whether it's your pastor فاذا كان قصك او رعيق or an apostle او رسول or a famous teacher on tv او معلم مشهور على التلفزيون you test their words against the word of god يجب ان تمتحن كلمته امام كلمه الله let's see another scripture on that دعونا نرى ايات اخرى 1 corinthians 10:15 في كورنثوس الاولى 10 15 Again, this is Paul speaking. Hona aidan Paulus yatakallam. First Corinthians 10:15. The Corinthians ul'ula 10 wa 15. In the letter he says, Yaqul fi al-risala, I speak as to wise men. Atakallam kama lilhukama. Judge for yourself what I say. Ahkumu antum fi ma aqul. Wow. This is Paul. Hona Rasul Paulus. So Louise, if we need to test Paul's words, if I were listening to him back 2,000 years ago, don't you think I need to test everyone's words today? Always test what you hear. Test all things in accordance with the word of God. Yes, Marisol. That is so critical. He wrote the prison epistles. He wrote so many epistles that were inspired by God. He heard from the Holy Spirit and were called to judge his word. When he was speaking, we need to judge everything we hear. Right. Prophetic words, the books we read, the preaching, the advice people give us, the little pamphlet we find, the verses and songs, everything. Because our spiritual life depends on it. الكلام الذي نسمعه في الكريم لأن حياتنا كلها تعتمد على هذا الأمر. We have to guard it. يجب أن نحرص حياتنا. Guard our salvation. يجب أن نحرص خلاصنا. With the truth. بالحق. The word. بالكلمة. This is the measure. هذا هو المعيار أو المقياس الذي نقيس عليه. Amen. Amen. Another scripture. في آيات أخرى. First John four one. في يوحنا الأولى. First John, four one. And this is talking to the church. John says, "Beloved, do not believe every spirit, but test the spirits, whether they are of God." Because many false prophets have gone out into the world. Ooh, we heard about false apostles. We hear about false prophets. Now just so you're clear, they're actually in the church. Test them. And Maris, I want to just stop for a second and talk about how the Word of God says to test them. When we hear a Word of God or a prophetic word, Marisol knows this is the first thing we do. I always check the Word of God to make sure what was said is consistent with the word of God. For example, if someone says you must tithe 10% of the sale of your home 10% from the sale of your home and give it to the church that's a false word. I wish I had time to go into this. But you're to give with joy. 
يجب أن تعطي بفرح. Not out of compulsion. ليس عن اضطرار. And if you sell a home, وإذا بعت منزلك. You are to tithe on the gain from the sale of the home. يجب أن تعشر ما ربحت فقط المكسب الذي ربحته. Not from the sales proceeds. لا ليس من أصل المال الذي اشتريت به. Because if I buy a home for fifty thousand, لأني إذا اشتريت منزل بخمسين ألف. And I sell the home for fifty thousand. وبعت المنزل بخمسين ألف. I have no income. ليس لدي دخل هنا. Therefore, there's no tithe. فلذلك لن يكون هناك عشر. But even this week, لكن هذا الأسبوع, we had two people call us. اتصل بنا شخصين. Where their pastor said tithe on the full fifty thousand. يا يا قال لهم القصة أن يعشروا الخمسين ألف. Even though they had no gain on the house. حتى لم يكونوا كسبوا أي مال في هذا ال في هذا في بيع المنزل. That's not of God. وهذا ليس من الله. That's manipulation. Wow. That's manipulation. فهذا تلاعب. And we we can we'll go to all the scriptures someday on giving. سوف نأتي إلى الآيات كلها الخاصة بهذا الأمر. But trust me, that's Maybe not of God. صدقوني. But the point being. لكن الأمر أو النقطة المهمة هنا. We read the word together with these people. أننا قرأنا الكلمة مع هؤلاء الأشخاص. And after reading the word. وبعد أن قرأنا معهم الكلمة. They didn't take that money and give it away. لم يأخذوا المال which was the only money they had to buy another home لأنه كان المال الوحيد معهم لشراء منزل آخر لهم and God saved them from that والله أنقذهم من هذا الأمر Amen Amen Now, so when we hear a word Use what? When we hear a word لعندما نسمع كلمة we test against the word of God يجب أن نمتحنها قصات كلمة الله Now this is really important وهذا مهم جدا we have the Holy Spirit inside of us. When I hear a true word, I have peace and joy that wells up inside of me. Marisol knows this. And the Holy Spirit falls on me. And for me, it's like a buzzing bee holding in your hand. It just comes down me. وتأتي علي من رأسي إلى. And he confirms the word is true. فتحقق لي أن الكلمة حقيقية. But when a word is false. لكن عندما تكون الكلمة كاذبة. I hear this loud no. أسمع هذه ال لا العادية داخلي. And I feel ugly and it feels wrong. وأف وأشعر أن هناك أمر قبيح وأمر خطأ. That's the Holy Spirit. هذا هو الروح القدس. Who is the spirit of discernment. وهو روح التمييز. Inside of us. داخلنا. Who is the spirit of truth? وهو روح الحق. And will tell us who is what is true and false. وسوف يخبرنا ما هو الحق وما هو ال ال الكذب. And what happens to me? وما حدث معي? I feel like I want to throw up. أشعر أشعر بالغسيان إذا سمعت كلمة كذبة. And then the Lord. والرب. Brings to me. يأتي إلي. Scriptures. بالآيات. That. Tell me what they're saying is not correct. That's right. Because if you study the word, the Holy Spirit will bring to memory the scriptures you need to discern if something is true or false. That's a scripture she just quoted, basically. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. So we're going to pray. Yes. And this is a big deal. We all need to grow up in Christ. Yes. We're all high priests. We all must diligently read the word. And this will not only protect us and our families. But it will assure our salvation and our sanctification. And that we finish the race. In the perfect will of God. So we're going to pray Philippians 1. 9 through 11. So Philippians 1. 9 through 11. We're going to pray it over all of us. And this I pray that your love may abound more, still more and more in knowledge 
and all discernment. وفي كل فهم وتمييز. That you may approve the things that are excellent. حتى تميز الأمور المتخالفة. That you may be sincere. لكي تكونوا مخلصين. And without offense until the day of Christ. وبلا عصرة إلى يوم المسيح. Being filled with the fruits of righteousness. مملوئين من ثمر البر. Which are by Jesus Christ. الذي بيسوع المسيح. To the glory and praise of God. لمجد الله وحده. So Father. أبانا. Put into our hearts. ضع في قلوبنا. A hunger and a desire for your word. جوع ورغبة لكلمتك. Even as a prodigal son, you put into my heart a hunger for the word. We lay our spiritual hands on our brothers and sisters that you will receive the hunger for the word. And you will hunger and thirst for his kingdom and his righteousness through the word of God all the days of your life. Be blessed in this. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Wow, what a blessing, brothers and sisters. What a blessing. So remember, study to show yourself approved. It is a blessing. The Lord loves you. Sister Louise. Dexter, أخويا Dexter, and myself, وأنا, we Amen. love you. نحن أيضا نحبك. And we can't wait to talk to you next week. ولا نستطيع انتظار حتى نكلمكم المرة القادمة. This has been your program. هذا كان برنامجكم. Shalom, shalom. سلام, سلام. سلام, سلام. سلام, سلام. Be blessed. Be blessed. كونوا في البركة.